Welcome to the Hearts Physical Therapy Postgame Presser. Standing here with Coach Kirchhoff, Township winning 6-1 to one over Solanco, game one of the 2024 season. Coach, I'll start off your 100th win. Uh, you know, came on a, a cold day here. Great pitching outing from uh, Braden Lead. Some good offense from the team. Good way to start the season. Talk about it. You never know what's going to happen on the first game of the year. Uh, you know, a little anxious, a little anxiety building up and uh, excitement, obviously. Happy we came out on the good side. Uh, some good things th here throughout today. We get some good starting pitching like we did today. B did a great job, gave us what we needed. And uh, we got a couple key hits. You know, not a clean game. It's hard to be picky on the first game of the year because we have room to grow. Uh, that's what we told the boys. We're just going to go back at it. Let's, car let's kind of build off of this and, and see what happens. And, um, you know, there's more out there for us, uh, you know, obviously, as a team and as a program. But uh, one of those is always better than no one. Coming off of another uh, state playoff appearance last year, what did you do in the offseason with this team uh, to prepare to hopefully make a repeat run this year? Uh, you know, just, just trying to kind of build some confidence. We knew we had some guys that were going to take over some positions that hadn't had a ton of playing time. Uh, Christian Kleckner is the epitome of that. Uh, he's put in a lot of time in uh, in the offseason, weight room, ground balls, you know, put in the work. I was glad to see him come out here and do a great job. I've been rooting for him. As, a, as, as coaching staff, we're pulling for, for him. He, he did a great job today. It's just really happy to see the hard work pay off. You know, you're going to have games, and you're going to have good games and bad games. He had a good game today, and uh, I'm, real, I'm really happy to see that. But what we did differently, we just went back to work. I mean, we kind of know what we're doing. We just had to go back to work and instill some confidence in the boys, um, get them ready to play, and, and, and we're doing the best we can. So, like I said, just really happy to see it. You know, Braden Lee pitched a great game today. Great job with the uh, in the weight room for, for B all, all, all winter long. So just kind of, all you see things start to pay off. Good way to start the season. You got it. Yep. Thank you. Also standing here with Braden Lee. Braden got the win today. Six innings uh, in your first outing. Uh, no runs. Nine strikeouts. You, you were really laying them down there. Yeah. Talk about how uh, that felt coming out here. A little chilly, but good start to your season. Yeah, I mean, it felt great, obviously. Baseball weather, though, it's Pennsylvania. I mean, it's going to be chilly all year round. I mean, first year out with the boys, you're going to have some adrenaline. Warms you up inside. It's not as cold as it feels to fans watching. It's a lot warmer for me out on that mound, being around my boys, going out there, first game of the season for sure. Yeah, and even from, you know, the first inning, I saw your emotion on the mound uh, getting to you after you get your third out. You're hyped up. Is that what you go into every game with and not just in pressure situations? Yeah, no, I mean, every game, doesn't matter who you're playing, when it is in the season, you got to go out there. I mean, game starts with the first pitch on by the pitcher, so you're the one to set the tone for that for your team. It transfers over, especially at home games. You get big inning ender on the mound. It transfers over to your hitters. It, it all flows throughout the game. You just got to keep that going. Thinking about your next outing, what are you looking forward to? What do you need to improve on? What are you going to work on in between? Uh, I'm just going to work on staying dominant with the fastball. I worked a lot today. Um, curveball looked good, but um, definitely some room to improve. Can't leave it up. Um, can't leave fastball is too good. Can't miss too much with two strikes. Um, looking back, it was a good outing, but most importantly, ready to get out and get another one with my boys. Hey, good job today. Thank you. Yep. Lastly, standing here with Christian Kleckner. Christian, you started out a short today, went three for three at the plate, scored a run, drove in two RBIs. First game of the season, you came out firing. Talk about it. I mean, it's great to be back out here. Obviously, you just want to put the ball in play, make some things happen, create some chaos, and uh, we did that today. Could find, uh, found a couple of barrels here and got the win. What did you do in the offseason to uh, prepare for you know, a big moment like this? A lot of work with Coach Kirchhoff, work in the weight room, you know, getting outside with some of these guys, hitting, fielding, doing all that good stuff. Your senior year, a win in game one's great. Where do you see this team going from here? Uh, I see it only going up. It looks great, and uh, it's a good group of guys, so can't wait for the rest of the year. All right, thanks. Good luck the rest of the year. Thank you.